And we're going to try to get our breakfast here early and head on down Tampa Bay. We've got a front about two days behind us. Got our generator running and uh, coffee's on. I'm going to show you a few things while we're waiting here. Um, yesterday we covered 59.6 miles. We took on uh, 11 gallons of fuel at mile number 46. Now, how do we know, you know, what we're doing here, where we're going? Well, we've got our chart for one thing. Anytime you buy more than uh, five of the large charts, uh, you're better off to get one of these booklets with a bunch of charts in them. Now this one covers all the way uh, down from almost my house, coming down through Tampa Bay, and uh, we'll go across Lake Okeechobee. Now eventually what we're going to do is take this Great Loop route. And that's my house. We'll come down across all the way up to New York and down the Mississippi. Or we might jog over here and take the Ten Tom Waterway uh, down to uh, Mobile and across instead of coming down this section of the Mississippi because that's almost all commercial traffic and uh, there's very little dockage. In fact, there's no dockage very little fuel uh, for a uh, cruising boat. Now, when I'm coming down, well, how do I know if there's a McDonald's or, or anything like that? Well, I can get these waterway guides, and there's lots of them, and uh, the numbers correspond. In other words, I can go over here and find out, oh, there's a Johnny Leverrock's uh, restaurant over here fuel here and so forth and and so on and it'll take you right on around to uh, Texas we're in new showing you New Orleans right now but uh, it'll take you all the way around waterway guide I'm hoping you're seeing this, but uh, after you come out of the McDonald's, you've got the Sun Cruise fun ship. You've got to make a jog to starboard, to the right, pick up the uh, intercoastal again if you want to keep deep water. Now, we're keeping 10 feet so far going down through here. Now, I've come out of the bridge. We've made our turn to starboard. And we've got a straight shot right on down the waterway. Now, marker 19, we're going to start taking another jar of 
jog to starboard here. Got uh, three hotels down there. That's a good mark for you. And we'll go under this bridge over here. Look at that, they're opening the bridge for us. still going down the waterway I'm going back up it right now but I just wanted to show you as you come out of the bridge you don't want to get confused unless you've got hotels will be here on your island side now see that's the intercoastal going down there but when you come out of the bridge you can be lined up on this waterway right here with the three hotels we saw earlier. Here in a coastal head off to starboard here. We we'll get down here to the condominiums. We're going to take our turn to port now. You really have to pay attention down here to what you're doing. Now the my uh, navigation unit makes it makes it really super easy but uh, you don't want to depend on that stuff too much because you never know it will go out on you so you always want to know where you're at what you're doing now we're coming on down the waterway we're still in this slow speed zone there's a lot of them all the way down to Venice on the intercoastal here and while we're doing that we've got the hotel lined up I'll show you a few things. Now the Sea Dory has a, I've got a fridge, you know, I've got, got to have my TV. I'm trying to learn how to uh, play keyboards right now, so I've got uh, my DVDs and uh, of course I play the guitar. It's got a uh, diesel stove, 40 hours on a gallon of diesel, so you've got everything you need to, to really to, to camp and live on the on the water now this is not not a yacht I mean it's you're it's camping on the water as opposed to living in luxury on the water but it really has no equal that I know of now we've come from our condominiums and we're coming on down the waterway looks like at the police station down here we're gonna take another turn to the port go under the bridge and film these directions draw opens Monday through Friday 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Saturday and Sundays and holidays let's see uh, 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. on the hour and each 20 minutes thereafter we'll run on down the bay we can kick it up a notch in speed and here's our turn Continuing our turn to starboard, and we're just going to go right on around. It's starting to kick up a little bit, at least we're on the bay. And uh, we're going to cross Tampa Bay here shortly. That should be an experience. 